yes, 40. If you're under 40, you don't remember the Harlem Globetrotters uh, cartoon. And I'm pretty sure you can go to YouTube and see, you know, an episode or clips or whatever. I mean, YouTube has everything. God bless YouTube. Two of the biggest inventions in the past, I don't know, 500 years are the wheel and YouTube. From Vince Wright, number one seed Harlem Globetrotters. Ninjas, you crazy? <laughs> number one, that BPA worthy, Doug. No. No, no, no. Uh-uh. Nah, they, uh, they should have been a number one seed. From J. Clyde, since I don't recall half of these cartoons, I watched majority of sports starting around age five. You a damn liar. Stop it. Stop trying to act like you had to go to work at 7 or something like that. You watch cartoons at 7. I had to start start work around age 5. I started watching sports. From Vince Wright, no wonder Pink Panther advanced. Globetrotters cartoon was horrible, Doug. BPA for them being number one seed. I disagree with you, Vince. From uh, WTXTY in the chat room on Spreaker.com colonizing an ish. Vince going to catch a BPA for questioning the host. You're exactly right. You are exactly right. I'm glad you reminded me. <sighs> Had to reach down to get my note cards. So we'll put that on hold for a second. Let me grab a call. Caller, thanks for calling the Doug Stewart Show. What's your name? Where are you calling from? What you want to talk about? Doug Stewart, Vince Wright, the sports guy from the great state of Minnesota. How you doing, my friend? I'm doing great, old Vince Wright. You about to get nominated for some ball penis, man. Hey, now remember, Doug, <laughs> as the official creator of whoa, the whoa, BCA, whoa, 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 wait, 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 lifetime exemption. Wait, 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 back up, wait, back up. Say that one more time. As the creator. Of the BPA. Yes, that's me, people. Vince Wright, the Sports Gov. I passed the idea along the tree. She ran it past you. And because of that, and I got it on tape, you saying that you gave me a lifetime exemption for the BPA. So I ain't worried about it. Wow, Vince, you, uh, you pull rank on a nigga, huh? Vince, you uh, you're exactly right, man. Here, here is your ball peanuts nomination card. I am tearing it up. You are exactly right, Vince. Right. <laughs> you are exactly right, Vince. Right. I have just torn up your ball peanuts award nomination. You are exactly right. Because you came up with the term ball peanuts for the Buster of the Week at Sports Entertainment and Beyond, we have torn up your nomination. You are 100% right, Vince Wright. Yeah. Wow. Old Vince pool ranked on a nigga. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, but you're right, Vince. Oh, boy, you're right. You're right. Yeah. From Sluggo, right, Gov. Doug needs a selection committee. From uh, Sam Daddy, is this Vince? I'm going to be quick. The people vote for Tiffany Wright. I will say this, though. I will say this about Vince. Is that, to quote the great Tupac Shakur, I ain't a killer, but don't push me. Now, you pushed and you led a campaign to, to not give Tiffany Sports and Heels the Ball Penis Award one week, a couple of weeks ago. You just called up here and you, in effect, back-talked the host. But, you know, you were right. You were right in, in your whole you know, reasoning on me never giving you a Ball Penis Award. You're exempt from the Ball Penis Award because you did come up with said ball penis award. That being said, I ain't a killer, but don't push me. (laughs) 
All right? So this doesn't give you free reign to just, you know, run amok in the chat room. It just doesn't give you free reign to call up the show host, which is me, and be belligerent. All right? It does not give you a pass to do that. We just tore up your BPA nomination. But just remember, I ain't a killer, so don't push me. From X W X T Y, Colin Eisen ish, my bad gov low key snitched on you. Uh, no, you didn't snitch. You did what you were supposed to do as a Stewie. You brought it to my attention. You brought it to my attention. That Vince is kind of, you know, poking his chest out a little bit, like Star Lord. Where's Star Lord's bracket at? Speaking of which. <laughs> which one is your bracket in the in the Doug Stewart show bracket challenge, Star Lord? Huh? What's your name? Huh? I don't see you on this top damn list of, of stew brackets long story short but star lord won the stew's bracket challenge last year the doug stewart show bracket challenge last year and last week he was poking out his chest talking uh you know yin yang from uh t-dub voice getting high pitch man you geeky as hell nothing wrong with that <laughs> I mean, this is my show, but you don't call up here and just push me. I'm not a killer, but don't push me. Don't push me. You up there from Minnesota calling down to my show, puffing your chest out all big and bad? Boy, you crazy. Boy, you fool. And from Derek. My bracket is trash. Vince basically called up there and asked Doug if he was going to eat his cornbread. <laughs> no, no. It wasn't to that level. I mean, wait a minute. Y'all saying that Vince called up here and poked me? Oh, whoa, no, no. Vince didn't poke me. No, don't look at it like that. Vince just used his constitutional right to call up and have a discussion. That's all. Right. Vince is my man. Uh, the, the governor of Sports Talk in Minnesota from Vince Wright X Squad. I'm working on all exemptions for X Squad. Laugh out loud. Oh, you can cancel that. Nah, you can forget that, Jack. I ain't giving no more exemptions. You got the one and only exemption from getting the Ball Penis Award nomination. The one and only. I don't care who from your little X Squad crew. I don't care if it's Kesey, Vern, whoever, ducking and dodging. X Squad, I love X Squad, but X Squad get BPAs just like everybody else. <laughs> Mr. Harper, Visto Doug, put the gun down and get knocked out like your father used to. <laughs> oh, all of a sudden, Vince Debo now, huh? From T Dub, that boy. Man, yo, I give anybody I want a BPA. Three thirty four, Bama boy, Gov Mush Doug in the back of the head. Oh, wait a minute now, wait a minute, y'all slow up. Slow. From Sluggo, I bet that clip won't go up on YouTube. From Rel the Intern Scott, Doug can't even call Vince Gov anymore. He has to call him Mr. Right. <laughs> Ducking and dodging Doug. Vince, you're getting a BPA Vince. She. <laughs> Man, that ninja call up here in like 30 seconds. Vince called up here in 30 seconds. Whoa, 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 Doug, whoa. From Sidney Jackson, the only other ninja who was exempt was the Grizz. No matter how much crazy-ish that dude said, Doug would never nominate him. Well, listen, I, I, I really have an issue nominating show hosts that have shows that air on Stewart Media and Entertainment Network. You know, the only exception to that rule is Vern from Jersey. But, like, I don't think I've never nominated, like, Barbershop Sports Talk or... 
or that ninja or, you know, anybody like that. Um, no, I've never done that. I've never nominated nobody else. <laughs> Kesey. Kesey, Mr. Harper. I've never nominated anybody else. From uh, X-Squad, kicking it with Kesey. Vince gave Doug the BPA this week. Whatever. I'm the all-knowing BPA giver. Um, KC, Vince to Doug. Do you know who the F I am? <laughs> See, what y'all doing right now is y'all trying to, uh, to to gas this thing up so that I will give Vince a BPA nomination. But one thing you don't know about me is I have never fallen to peer pressure, ever. WTXTY, colonizing an ish. Grizzly took his ball, or Grizz took his ball and went home. Haven't heard from him. Uh, Grizz is going to be back on the network very soon. A lot of the shows that we had before on the network will be back on the Stewart Media Entertainment Network very soon. Uh, plus a couple of new shows live. All right. All live. All right. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for that. Miss um, Mocha Bella, Doug, you damn sure gave. Uh, BPA to Tiffany and Thorny, didn't you? Uh, they're not X Squad members, are they? They they don't have shows on the network, do they? I I, I think you're wrong about that. That <laughs> most of which all blossom from listening to the Stuart Media Entertainment Network and so they kind of got their own little click, you know, kind of like the diplomats or or uh you know, some other little rap click. And uh so they a lot of their shows are on the network at, at one time or another and so it's all good. We family. The only person that's an exception to the rule of me taking care and looking out for X Squad is Vern from Jersey just because he's ignorant a lot of times. Right. He's just ignorant a lot of times. So Vern, I mean, a lot of time Vern does it to himself. So, you know, pay no attention to that. Pay no attention to Vern. I mean, she's just, he's just Vern. Uh, uh, what time is it? We got to get out of here. Uh, I almost feel like doing bonus stew. Oh, I forgot. The third hour is bonus stew. Time to go. Time to go. When Tupac was around. Yeah. He wanted to raise a nation of thugs. But, uh. Yeah, I think it's only right for me to raise a nation of brothers. Frank Cole, and it's just Oscar Cooper. Hey, thank you for joining me today on the Doug Stewart Show. Man Talk Monday, tomorrow Tribute Tuesday. As I mentioned earlier, man, we're going to pay homage to the great Chuck Berry. Uh, incredible career, man. Passed away at the age of 90. Wow. So that's going to be some fun tomorrow. Um, Shouts out to my producers, Waterhead, Walter Poe, Politicking, Consultant, Brandon Butler. Yeah. Shouts out to my engineers, Dwayne Bassan, Gerald Oliveri. Thank you all very much for doing what you all do. Uh, my man, John Gorenfell, who's building this website. Hopefully, we'll have it ready by the end of this week. Y'all going to love it. I'm telling you. You're going to love it. Okay? Uh, special shouts out to my man, Pink Gator, for this hot-ass track. Yeah. All right. We'll do it again tomorrow. Make sure you vote on the field of 64. We got 32 left. Trying to knock it down to 16. So go to the Doug Stewart Show Facebook chat group and cash your vote. Feel the 64 cartoons. Trying to come up with the best cartoon of all time. So says you. All right. We'll do it again tomorrow. Same Doug Stewart time. Same Doug Stewart channel. Y'all be careful on them streets. Peace. When Tupac was around. He wanted to raise a nation of thugs. But uh, I think it's only right for me to raise a nation of brothers. Frank Cole, Ernest J.
Jets. Oscar Cooper.